Did you know that 60 of newborn babies develop jaundice? But here's the surprising part. Most parents don't know the cause, symptoms, or how to treat it. As a new parent, it's essential to understand what's going on with your baby's health. So, let's dive into the world of newborn baby jaundice. Jaundice is a common condition that causes yellowing of the skin and eyes in newborns, usually appearing two to three days after birth. It's not a disease, but rather a sign that your baby's liver is working overtime to process a buildup of bilirubin, a pigment that's created when old red blood cells break down. Think of it like a traffic jam in your baby's system. The liver is working hard to clear the congestion, but it needs a little extra help. Here's the good news. Jaundice is treatable with phototherapy or medication. In fact, most babies with jaundice can be treated and go on to lead healthy lives. But what's crucial is early detection and treatment. If left untreated, jaundice can cause brain damage and long-term complications. So, how can you spot the signs and get your baby the help they need? We'll be exploring that in the next section. One thing's for sure, being informed and proactive as a parent can make all the difference in your baby's health and well-being. You've been caring for your newborn baby for a few days now and everything seems normal. But here's what most parents don't know. Jaundice symptoms can be subtle and easily mistaken for normal newborn behavior. Your baby might not show any obvious signs of illness, but that doesn't mean they're not in trouble. When a baby develops jaundice, it's usually because their liver isn't producing enough of a chemical called bilirubin, which helps break down old red blood cells. As a result, bilirubin builds up in the body and causes the skin, eyes, and mucous membranes to turn yellow. You might notice your baby's skin looks a bit darker than usual, or their eyes appear more yellow than they should. But that's not all. Jaundice can also cause your baby to become lethargic, poor feeder, and even vomit. These symptoms can be really worrying, especially if you're not sure what's going on. The thing is, untreated jaundice can lead to some serious complications. If left unchecked, it can cause brain damage, hearing loss, and vision problems. That's why it's essential to keep a close eye on your baby's health and seek medical attention if you notice any unusual symptoms. As a new parent, it's natural to feel a bit overwhelmed, but here's the thing, some babies are more at risk for jaundice than others. If your baby has dark skin or you come from so, what can you do to prevent or treat jaundice in your newborn? As a new parent, it's essential to take proactive steps to reduce the risk of jaundice. One of the most effective ways to do this is through breastfeeding. Breast milk promotes bowel movements and helps eliminate bilirubin, a pigment that can cause jaundice. In fact, studies show that breastfed babies are less likely to develop jaundice than formula-fed babies. But what if your baby is already showing symptoms of jaundice? In that case, phototherapy is often the most effective treatment. This involves placing your baby under a specialized light, which helps break down bilirubin and reduce the risk of damage to the brain and other organs. You can even do phototherapy at home using a portable light therapy unit. However, it's crucial to consult with your healthcare provider to determine the best course of treatment for your baby. Monitoring bilirubin levels is also critical for early detection and treatment of jaundice. By checking your baby's bilirubin levels regularly, you can catch any potential issues early on and take action to prevent complications. Remember, every baby is different, so it's essential to work closely with your healthcare provider to develop a personalized treatment plan that meets your baby's unique needs.